YouTubers and welcome to another product review by moveproductions.com Today what I have for you is really a comparison between in my eyes the two best monitor speakers in the entry or mid-level for mixing tracks in your studio um, Yeah, let's see what I have for you. So we're checking today and this package really just come this week the KRK Rocket 5 Generation 4 monitor, near field monitor speaker. And you see it on the white box. This is actually the limited white noise edition, which is in my eyes a beautiful studio speaker in white. Um, that's the one we're testing. Please also check. We have a signal review, especially for the KRK Rocket. Today I just give you my opinion and my experiences between this one and number two. A great value speaker definitely is the M Audio BX5 Delta 3, also available at the 8 inch speaker, um, in the studio near field speaker. So the M Audio is actually. Um, when I screen the Marcus, the most valuable monitor speaker at a low price of around 90 US dollar per speaker, you can really create your home studio. So let me just give you the sh most important information um, of the two speakers. You can see it also. <clears throat> I'm now working with the M Audio in my studio. And of course, I will install then the Rocket 5 as a next step. Uh, I formerly had the black edition, so now I just ordered the white one. So about the two speakers over here, um, we're just comparing the M only about ninety dollars per speaker, and the KRK Rocket 5, which is then around one hundred sixty bucks per speaker, black or white. Um, definitely, definitely two great speakers in my eyes both with enough power for any home studio, so anything regarding um, RMS power or amplifier, active um, monitor speaker, so you have enough power for your home recording studio. More important in my eyes is the sound, you know. So when it comes to have great linearity and clarity for mixing your tracks, then you will hear definitely some little differences between the two. So let me just explain you. Um, which are here the most important um, differences between the two speakers. Um, also, you maybe have seen it on the intro picture of this video review. So the size of the speaker is a little bit different. The M Audio is rather smaller and a bit thinner than the KLK Rocket 5. So also when you look here on the speakers at my desk, even it's a 5 inch speaker, same size as the KRK Rocket, it uh, looks a little bit smaller. Might be good if you don't have that much space in your studio. If you have monitor stands like I have here, um, it could be definitely be a bit, little bit bigger from a size perspective. So what is really different? I mean on the KRK Rocket 5 you have a lot of technical options to adapt your room settings and room acoustics and the question is really do you need it in your individual room because I'm working here in a regular flat um, with no room absorbing uh, elements and it's still working very fine if you're using the magic triangle you see it here I have the optimum um, seating position when I'm mixing my tracks so it's about a 60 degree angle to my speakers and the high level frequencies are right at the head of my ears so that's the perfect um, positioning here for mixing my tracks also here um, let me just mention we have a separate review then on YouTube um, which is quite worthful so um, power more the same technical issues LED display on the KRK at the back you have several options to um, adapt it to your room acoustic, equalizing power, volume. Um, compared to the M audio, where you just have three options 
to adapt it um, to your room. So you have just a minus 2 dB or minus 4 dB um, and base decrease you can use on your speakers. And maybe that's an important thing because when I'm just hearing my tracks, my reference tracks or um, any chart tracks, M Audio comes with a lot of bass power um, and you can hear some little differences in the high frequencies. Maybe the KRK there is a little bit clearer. Um, yeah, reflects more the high frequencies and maybe on the mid frequencies you don't hear that much difference in my eyes. So both are perfect to mix your tracks. But at the end I would say the KRK is a bit, little bit clearer also have, has plenty of bass, which is more than enough because I heard also other reference monitors which really have then a lack of passes and where you have to use an additional subwoofer on your system and I really don't like that because I just need two speakers that are working well. Um, so I actually say BX5 for me is perfect when I use this um, um, Base deduction and on the room acoustics, that's the only thing I do, just minus 2 dB, minus 4 and then for me it's perfect working in this room. Even I have the speakers pretty close to the wall, I don't have big reflections from the side walls or anywhere in the room. So for the $90 per speaker I have to say I'm really very happy with the M audio. And the KRK of course from the look and feel design, even the white noise edition is really an eye catcher to me, um, for me one of my most favorite speakers here from the look and feel and design. Even it costs um, nearly the double of the M audio. So that's more or less in a nutshell everything about the two speakers. And I give you afterwards some sound examples here that you can compare the sound in this room. Maybe we take also here kind of hip hop one. <laughs> Thank you.